It is a fan that actually flushes out your entire house. I'm starting over again. I'm Tom Ryan. I'm an energy project manager at UC Davis in the Energy Conservation Office. Today, I'm here to talk to you about whole house fan. Okay, over the course of the day, the structure of your house itself actually stores up a lot of the energy from the sun. All that heat has to go somewhere. So it gets stored in the wood and the drywall and the drapes and your couch, everything. So the problem is your HVAC system at the end of the day has to deal with all of that heat and it's working and it's working but it's still not cooling down your house. Well, the reason is, it's actually pulling all that heat from all of the surfaces inside your house. So a whole house fan will actually help with that. Once that sun goes down and it starts to cool off, unfortunately in Davis, that's around 11 p.m., it actually starts getting pretty nice. So what we'll do is we'll open up the window and then we'll turn on our whole house fan. Generally, that's in the attic space somewhere turn that on, it actually pulls out all that hot air and then draws in nice cool air from the outside. It's very low energy and it'll actually help the HVAC system do its job. All right, we're going to take a look at a new install of a whole house fan at a house in the neighborhood. All right, and it's actually right above your head. We've left off the finished grill here so that you can see inside the ductwork. You can't actually see the whole house fan itself because it's way up in the attic, but we're gonna turn it on for you in a second and you can see how it works. First, we have to open up a window or a door because we have to let some air in. Otherwise, your fan is gonna be working way too hard and you're not gonna be saving a lot of energy. So there's your nice cool air and it's really hot and stifling in this space. So we wanna turn on our whole house fan. There it is, our whole house fan is on. Can you hear it? Now a whole house fan will work great for a small house like this, but at a large scale university, like the University of California, Davis, we would use something closer to what is called an economizer. Now an economizer uses the temperature and the fresh air from the outside when we don't need to actually heat or cool the inside. We can actually just bring in outside air. That takes care of high CO2 levels, which aren't great for health. And it also brings in nice comfortable temperature that we don't really have to make cooler or warmer. We can just use that nice temperate outdoor air temperature when we need to. To hear more about that and other things, visit us at eco.ucdavis.edu and check out our other content and blogs on Instagram and YouTube. Thanks.